Welcome to JC Outdoor Fever. Today's episode, we're going to be on segment nine. We're only going to do probably half of it because it's a long one. We'll come in from the other side of another one. So. My chores are finally done. Am I taking a break? You better believe her. I'm gonna sit right here and watch JC's Outdoor Fever. Here's the park. There's the main entrance to the trail. And we got summer. Showing the way. Seven dollars for day use, thirty-five I think for the county pass, which gets you in um, segment ten and segment nine here. So far that's all we know. Drops right off. Oh, look at this. This is gorgeous. Goes up this big old hill here. Trying to videotape without uh, tripping over the dog. I just kicked a piece of wood down there so I'm getting it off the bike trail so nobody would hit with the front tire and wipe out. Hit that doing 10, 15 mile an hour. Look at that. That is gorgeous. Yeah. Let's videotape a little bit of this. It's gorgeous through here. So far this whole trail is not disappointing at all they picked a great route through the through the side of the hill here carved it out we we're playing this so far is doing a good job <clears throat> there's a there's a ramp or your bike and just run right up that rock and jump hey look at that there's a tail light they're using for part of the ramp yeah I fear there would be a few more mosquitoes today than we we're used to seeing because it rained But they don't seem to be overwhelming. <laughs> Surprised they didn't take that tree down. Oh yeah. Leaning over the trail. Yep. Bending those two trees right over. Holding up all that dead weight. Looks like it goes down the hill and back around over to that side of the ravine. All right, we come up on the ridge here, and the water's way down there. Oh, that looks gorgeous. There's a little beach down there. The, the party boats are sitting there all lined up. You can't hardly see them through the trees. But they're down there. 
We can spend the night down there or whatever, probably. Spend the whole day there. I like to play in horseshoes. <laughs> Who knows? All right, we got some interesting little hill coming up. We got a, another rock or two here, place so you can jump. It is gorgeous. Look at that. They probably had it, you know, definitely they didn't move that. It was just there. This one here, they could have placed that one because it's nice and flat and doesn't look too big. Look at this. Yeah, no mosquitoes yet, but I got a few uh, gnats. I can get in my ear. <laughs> yeah. They are messing with my ears a little bit. Other than that, beautiful. A fall color tour through here is probably going to be a must this fall. Don't you think so, Mother Susie? Yep. It is gorgeous. Is this something to do this fall? Looks like uh, when it rains hard, it, water goes down through that ravine out to the river. And this is so neat. This up and down. Love it. Well, again, finally getting up this ravine. And we got an overlook of the pond again. There's something orange over there, that tree. <laughs> See, this is the old trail right here. I bet you we can take this right down, shortcut, I don't know. You want to rest right here? I want to walk up just over there to see what that looks like. Winds up and around. It looks like we've got a new viewpoint. That uh, four-wheeler trail follows that up and around here. See, if you uh, had a boat, you can have your own little private beach right there. You can just hang out. Come on, Sam. We're coming up on the, oh, look at that. There's the party spot right there. Woo! That is gorgeous. Look at that. Going to do. Look at this little girl. She goes, eyes know the way, Dad. You just follow this trail. Look at that, Sums. Yeah, wet leaves and a little bit of clay with some moisture. Wow. Yeah, I like this segment so far the best. Yeah. I'm going back 
Well, a little bit. No, we're going to have to go uphill to get over there. Well, those uh, older gentlemen were riding their bike in this hot temp. Doing pretty good. They were no spring chickens. They were out here enjoying it. I'm just hoping we can get down to the water right here somewhere. No, probably not this time. I don't. I mean, if it was like this right now, I could. Cause I feel fine right now. Yep. Just... So there's a ravine there. All the hills. Yep. There's a ravine there and looks like the trail goes around to the point there, but I don't see where it goes down to the water. There's a jump right there. This part, all these trees they had to move move out of the way. There's a ravine down there. And I guess you're gonna have a boat or two down there, probably on your own little beach. I can hear some voices, so I'll probably got some bicyclists coming up behind us. I can't really see down there if that's. So it keeps on going around this ravine. Here's the view. Oxbow Park is straight across. And Hardy Dam is off that way. Around the bend. You can't even see it now. We're so far. Uh, Looks like uh, Consumers Beach is just right over here. No, yeah, that's not where we are. We're not there yet. <laughs> okay. Well, oh, maybe there it's... we go. Okay. <laughs> It is beautiful here, except for this particular area because it's calm. All the green algae is all over. You can't even get out and swim. I walked the dog out and uh, we put her on the other side of it. Okay. And the trail continues, but we're going to have to uh, do another part. No seg of this segment here. Trying to get back is hot. Thanks for watching JC Outdoor Fever and don't forget to get out there and explore and subscribe. Turtle sign himself as I walk along today. I see mama and her phone as I quietly pass their way. Ducks swimming in the pond and a beaver do I see Mother Nature at its best that's what's waiting for me I'll always be here I've got the beaver Out. Hey thanks for watching and please hit the subscribe button